In this class we will edit surfaces, controlling their vertices through the command 3 edit bar. Open the available file, where we have some surfaces already modeled, and let's get started. The command 3 edit bar reformats splines and nerves type surfaces. Controlling the vertices of surfaces through handles that are available to move a point and change the magnitude and direction at specific points. We trigger this command in the Surface tab, Control Vertices panel. Then we click on the surface and click on a base point for editing, which can be moved alternately through the X, Y or Z axes. We click on the x-axis and move the surface to direct the edit. We enter 10 as the value for the displacement of the vertex in the x-direction and press enter. See that we edit the surface by shifting the selected vertex by 10 mm on the x-axis. Let's continue with the editing process, repositioning the base point to the other end of the surface. Right clicking on the command icon 3 edit bar we have access to a number of configuration options for vertices control. We click on relocate base point and click on the new base point. Then we click on the x-axis and move the surface to direct the editing. We type 10 which is the value for the displacement of the vertex in the X direction and we press enter. Continuing the editing of the surface, we right click on the command icon 3 edit bar. We select relocate base point and click on the new base point. By default, the orientation of the 3D edit bar handle is aligned with the universal coordinate system but its alignment can be changed using the shortcut menu. To line the axis with the U, V and W axis of a NURB surface, we click on the arrow. In this case, we access the shortcut menu and select V tangent direction. We click on the tip of the arrow relative to the Z axis to edit the magnitude of the surface. Note that the arrow is highlighted in red, and we can then move and change the magnitude. If we click on the axis, we can move the point. See, we have the magnitude of the surface altered dynamically. We activate the shortcut menu of the command 3 edit bar and we will analyze other options. In move point location we move the location of the point changing the shape of the selected object when moving the base point. In move tangent direction we move the direction of the tangents, changing the shape of the selected object, and with this we change the slope of the tangent at the base point. In U tangent direction we can move the tangent on the U axis. In V tangent direction we can move the tangent on the V axis. In normal tangent direction we can move the tangent on the W axis, which is normal to the surface at the base point. In set constraint we define whether the change in the tangency, or change in the location of the point is restricted to a specific larger axis or plane. We can also relocate the base point, reorient the handle to align it with the WCS, UCS or with a selected face or object. We suggest that you edit the surfaces present in the file by navigating the options available in the command 3 edit bar, comparing the results to the end. We finish this class, where we present the command 3 edit bar, widely used in editing vertices on surfaces.